but a 100 watt solar panel on Amazon. This is a Mobi Solar 100 watt panel. The build quality looks very good. The panel is not too heavy, has a very easy way to deploy it because it has legs so you can always just angle the panel. So for example, okay, let's deploy this panel. <laughs> The panel has all the ports that you would possibly need. It has a USB 2 port. I'm guessing that's a 2 amp 5 volts. It has a quick charge 3 port. It has a power delivery port that is up to 100 watts. And a DC out that's up to 100 watts. And an XT60 connector, I guess, to charge batteries or connect it to various other things. So I don't have a device that can take 100 watts to test. I can have only a battery pack that takes 60 watts and I'm gonna connect it and we'll see what the panel puts into it again the maximum of this battery pack is uh, 60 watts so even though the panel probably does have 100 watts chances chances are <laughs> this battery pack will only go up to 60 okay let's get this thing connected let's see if we can see the screen of the battery pack Okay, plug this in, plugged in, let's see what's the wattage, so we're getting 50 watts, and that's probably the maximum of this battery pack can take because when I connected it via power delivery it was able to take 54 watts from 100 watt uh, power delivery power supply so this is likely the very maximum my battery pack can take I don't have anything else that's more powerful to see if the panel can really do 100 watts but it's maxing out all my devices okay, I'm also going to try charging my Dell tablet that uh, takes power delivery and needs a 60 watt power supply and we'll see if it charges this thing. Okay. okay. Plug in the power delivery cable. And I'm going to connect it to the solar panel's power delivery port. And I will see if this has charge. It takes charge. Okay. So now I'm charging my Dell tablet that supposedly is charging at 60 watts. And I'm also at the same time charging the battery pack at 26 watts. So my guess is this is 30 watts. So my guess is this is at least getting 90 watts, which is pretty good. So yeah, overall good solar panel, well designed, well built. Can charge your devices. Uh, can charge a laptop and a battery pack at the same time. 